guys, so I just have to share this with you because I am finding it totally hilarious. So, yes, it's still Super Bowl day, still same outfit, still gonna be uploaded same day and everything. Um, so we have like all our Super Bowl food out for this evening, afternoon, whatever right now. And right after I filmed my review from earlier, as it was uploading, I went and got a bowl of chili. Not thinking that with lip balm on my lips, the red from the sauce is going to stick to it, like, big time. Like, more so than chili normally does, right? Okay? So I'm, like, trying my darndest to keep wiping it off with every bite. It's just, like, my dad's looking at me like, what the hell? I was just, like, did not think this through. I, I just filmed a lip balm review right before I came down here. Hey, you hear the game on downstairs? Uh, but, yeah, so I just, like, did not think it through, so it, it's like sticking to, to my lip balm really bad, and he's like, okay, Kathy Chapstick, and I was like, Kathy Chapstick, wait, what the fuck, are you on crack? And he's like, no, no, Kathy Chapstick was a thing, I'm like, like, wait, what, wait, first question, was, was this like somebody that you knew and nicknamed this, or was this like actually a thing in the media? And he was like, no, 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 this was a thing, this was a thing, you can look it up. So I did, because I could give a fuck less about sports. I mean, like I said, I'm only in this for Gaga, and it's not halftime yet, so I'm bored till halftime. <laughs> yeah, I know, for as much of a tomboy as I am, sports are one masculine thing that I just cannot get myself interested in. Sorry. If you guys enjoy them, more power to you. Just, it's not my thing. But anyway, so... I go to Google, and I typed in Kathy Chapstick. Nothing came up for that, but a Susie Chapstick did. So I went and told that I was like, did, did you mean Susie Chapstick? He's like, oh yeah, yeah, that was her. I'm like, okay. So I got back to the computer, right? And I'm looking it up, and I'm looking on Google Images first, before I even went to YouTube. And there's all these old vintage magazine ads of this chick who apparently was like an Olympic like, gold medalist or something for skiing, I presume, from what I could gather anyway, for chapstick, and it's just like, oh my god, these are awesome, because, okay, I cannot be the only one who gets, like, the biggest kick out of, like, old print ads and old commercials. I am that person who they, like, have the target demographic for, of, like, the compilations of old 70s and 80s commercials that they put on YouTube, of, like, an hour long of just commercials. I am that person who sits here and literally watches them. I am not even joking right now. Uh, and I used to, like, be that person who'd buy, like, lots of, like, just old magazines so I could laugh at the ads or, like, scrapbook some of them that I thought were particularly amazing. Like, I have gone back even further than those eras with magazines. I've gone back to, like, 50s ones just because... I think they're amazing. Now, thankfully, there's websites for that, and I don't have to waste my money on that just to look and laugh, but I digress. <laughs> anyway, so I just, I had no idea this was a thing that existed. I want to know, did any of you guys know this was a thing? Because I didn't. Now I'm like, what, what other lip balm history am I unaware of that I probably should have known about, and I feel like I need to research now or something just because of what I do here on this channel? <laughs> Oh my gosh. But yeah, I, I totally highly recommend to you guys, if you want a cheap laugh, go to Google Image Search and just search in Susie Chapstick. I promise it's nothing like dirty or anything, it, it'll just like bring up her old print ads as well as like ads for her like exercise workout. But And then once you're done with those, then go to YouTube because there's totally old school commercials with this chick and they're hilarious. So I just wanted to share this with you guys because I'm just like... Oh my god, I feel like I have hit the jackpot today in old advertising, which, again, I don't know why this tickles me so much. It just does. I was definitely born in the wrong era, but yeah, I think these were just barely before my time. I think they were, like, late 70s from what I can gather. I was, like, born in 85, so I just missed out by, like, that much on these, but anyway, yeah, I, I felt the need to share it with you guys, and... Yeah, I'm sure that some of you have probably heard of it before and think I'm a total tard for never hearing this before today, but it was new to me, and I know a lot of my subscribers are way younger than I am and probably have never heard of this either, and 
might be just as amused. I don't know. So I thought I'd share it with you guys, and that's about all I have to say here. And I'm gonna go sit myself through some more boring sports and wait for Lady Gaga. So, anyway, <laughs> as usual, if you like this video, click the like button. If you're not already and you like to be, click subscribe. Leave comments down below. Let me know if you ever heard of Susie Chapstick before, and if you haven't, and you do go Google her and search the ads on YouTube, let me know what you think of those ads, because I'm just, like, so beyond amused right now. But yeah. Till next time. Bye!